Hello friends, today we are going to study about quadratic equation. So first of all you should know what is quadratic polynomial. If you are writing any polynomial 2x plus 5. So this is a polynomial and with variable x. Whenever any polynomial is having pi highest power 2 or you can say degree 2, 2x square plus 5. Then this polynomial is called quadratic polynomial. So this is quadratic polynomial. When you form an equation with this means 2x square plus 5 is equals to 0. So this is a quadratic equation. The actual standard form of any quadratic equation is ax square plus bx plus c is equals to 0. This is the standard form of any quadratic equation. This is also a quadratic equation. Generally, you will see numbers like this. 2x square plus 4x plus 5 is equals to 0. The number with x square, that will be your a. The number with x, that will be your b. And the last number, that will be your c. This is your quadratic equation. So, in quadratic equation, your b can be 0. Means, this, look here, here b is not there. Means, 2 uh, with number with x is not there. So, here you will get a is equals to 2. b is not there. b means b is equals to 0. And c is 5. Your b can be equals to 0. Means, you are with 2 terms also, you can form a quadratic equation. Or your c can be also equals to 0. Means, 2x square plus 3x is equals to 0. This is also a quadratic equation. Just you have to check the power. If power is 2, highest power is 2, or you can say the degree is 2, at that time it forms a quadratic equation. It can be single number also, 3x square equals to 0. So this is also your quadratic equation. This is the standard form, but this is also your quadratic equation. Here your b and c will be equals to 0 and your a will be 3. So this is the general form of quadratic equation. Now here in quadratic equation you can find two zeros means two factors. In any polynomial you have to just see the power. How many uh, numbers are there in power or means you, you can see the highest power that much zeros you can find out of that polynomial. So here it's quadratic equation means the highest power is 2. So you can get two factors of any quadratic equation. If I'm writing here x square plus 7x plus 10 equals to 0. So this is your quadratic equation. You can find out the factors of this quadratic equation and you will get two factors. Or you can get maximum two factors of any quadratic equation. You can get two different fa uh, factors two same factors or you will get no factors also but that you will learn in later. Now first of all you will listen this that this is your quadratic and you will get two factors. There are total three methods for solving this and finding the factors or zeros. First method is splitting the middle term. Splitting the middle term that you had uh, I had made separate videos for that all the three methods but you know, I think you, from lower standard, you are doing this in the middle term. So, you know that. Second method is completing the square method. And third method is quadratic formula. One formula is there by that also. I had made separate videos for this all three. If you want to see, you can see that also. So, this is quadratic. This is the introduction part of any quadratic e equation. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel so that I can bring more such videos. Thank you so much.